Yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And what's really interesting is that how we then see that the wounded part that is connected to one eye is often directly connected to the experience as if it's still happening. Yeah. It actually doesn't have any updated information that the person has with both eyes open. Just to give you a quick idea. So one of the clients I'm working with has fibromyalgia. And one of the things that we discovered is that as we were processing some of the trauma is that with her left eye open, she experienced herself as a five to six year old. And biologically, this person is in her fifties. And we discovered that with the right eye open, she was referencing the death of her parent 30 years ago. Yet when we move back to the left eye that was connected to that five, six-year-old, she did not know that parent had passed away. Yeah, it's pretty interesting. And this is what I'm seeing consistently without people having any specific diagnoses, that the brain does compartmentalize these experiences. And it appears that neurologically, there is no neurogenesis that actually happens to the present information when traumatic experiences have happened. 